Hi, I'm Slavic with iDrinkCoffee.com. Today I'm presenting the Chiato E37J Espresso Grinder. The J is the baby of the E37 family, meaning that it has the smallest burrs. It has 64 millimeter burrs as opposed to the S, which has 83 millimeter burrs. This grinder is suitable for light commercial or for home use. It really does a great job grinding for espresso. In order to present this grinder, I'm going to be going over the features. I'm also going to take a look inside the grinder, show you the burrs actually, how easy they are to remove. I'm going to show you how to program it. And then we're also going to do a dosing consistency test. I'm going to do a few doses of coffee and I'm going to weigh the results to show you the variance between each dose. Now I'm going to go over the features from top to bottom. The Chiato E37J comes standard with this small hopper. This hopper fits about 500 grams of coffee, but you can use the optional larger hopper with this if you like. It does fit. The hopper features the sliding door, so I can actually close this if I need to remove it. If I wanted to change the coffee or something like that, I can get rid of this coffee and change it and then put it back. Underneath the hopper, we have the grind adjustment mechanism. And the way this mechanism works is it has these two kind of indents which you can put your thumbs in and you move it to the right or counterclockwise in order to make the grind finer or clockwise to make the grind coarser. And of course that is stepless grind adjustment so there's no steps so you have an infinite range of adjustment. Next we have the touchscreen interface and in the latest version of the Chiato, uh, this is basically a soft touch. You just put your finger over it. It's very responsive, very easy to use. Here we program our doses. So your single shot, you have the button on the left and your double shot, the button on the right. And the way we change the programming is just by holding the button in for a few seconds and then I can adjust it. Currently my grind was set at five seconds. I can move it up to six and press the set button and now my single shot is six seconds. This is very intuitive, very, very easy to use, a real pleasure. Just below the touchscreen interface we have the chute and the chute is quite short so the grind chamber is just back here so they try to make the retention, the grind retention as little as possible. And below that we have the adjustable fork and the trigger. You can adjust this fork to fit your portafilter. I have an E61 portafilter right here which I can grind into. And again, you can hear how quiet the Chiato is. It's one of the quieter grinders on the market. Another really neat feature of the Chiato is the way the uh, grind mechanism, the burr chamber is set. Uh, you can actually remove the top burr without changing the grind setting. And I'm gonna do that. There's just three large Phillips screws. And of course I have the grinder turned off and unplugged when I'm doing this. Just remove these three screws and we have full access to the burrs. And then I just lift, lift this. And if I need to clean my burrs, I have very easy access. So this is the top burr that I've removed. And you can see that the entire mechanism is contained in this top burr section. That's really nice because when I put this back, my grind setting is going to be unchanged. Here we have the bottom burr or the burr that moves. And another thing that you'll notice here is that there's no thread. There's no fine threads like you'll find in other grinders that have those adjustment collars. Those are extremely hard to clean. Uh, I can get in here very easily with my brush and kind of brush my burrs. You'll also notice that in between the burr and the wall of the grind chamber, there's not that much space. I, I can actually, you see, move this. There's maybe, I'd say, I mean, I would estimate maybe two grams of, of retention there, maybe, maybe a little bit more, but there's not much space for the excess coffee to go. It just gets pushed out your chute so you don't have a lot of stale coffee. To put this back, very, very simple. I just put this back into place, and then I put my three screws back in, and I can start grinding once again. So the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to do a dosing consistency test. So this is a time grinder, so our uh, dose is set by time. I've got my double shot right now set at 6.7 seconds. As you can see, I've teared this container at 0.0 grams, and we're going to weigh the results with five consecutive shots to see what we get. So our first dose is 19.3 grams. Now 
with the motor running here, you can also hear how quiet the E37J is. Chiaro makes some of the quietest grinders on the market. Our second dose is 19 grams even. Third dose is 19.3. Fourth dose is 19.4 grams. And the fifth and final dose is 19.4 grams, or maybe 19.5. So as you can see, the variance is half a gram between five shots, which is really quite remarkable. You're not going to taste a difference uh, with a variance of half a gram in your cup. The Chiaro E37J has a lot of very sought after features. It's quiet motor, it's easy adjustability, and it's overall rugged design. It's very well made. These grinders are handmade in Venice, Italy. If you have any questions about the Chiaro E37J or any one of our products, please feel free to reach out and ask for help. We're always ready and happy to offer it. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos about coffee grinders, espresso machines, coffee machines, everything to do with coffee. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.